here we go. All right. Hi, I'm Dr. Terry Rapp. Today I wanted to talk a little bit about why bleeding when you're on the pill doesn't mean that you're on your period. Uh, a lot of women get confused about that. They think that any bleeding that they have is their period, but I wanted to talk about how the pill works and why um, periods are generally better when you're on the pill and some benefits of birth control pills in general. When I talk about the pill, I mean a progesterone and estrogen combination hormone pill. It is the you know original birth control, the pill that people always talk about. Um, how it, it works is a little different than what happens when you're not on the pill. And so in your body, when you are not on any hormones, your brain sends hormone signals to your ovaries, which then send hormone signals to your uterus. In the uterus, the lining gets nice and thick, anticipating a possible pregnancy. And so the hormone levels rise up, the lining gets thick, and then uh, when you don't get pregnant, the hormone levels drop and the lining sloughs off and that's a period. Typically that happens around once a month. When you're on the pill, you're on the same steady state of hormones every day. So unlike that big rise in hormones that you see on your own cycle, when you're on the pill, it's just a daily flat level of hormones that you take for three weeks. And then at the end of the pill pack, you have a seven days of no hormones. And then your body is recognizing a drop in the hormone level. And so if there is any lining in the uterus, that comes out with that drop in hormone levels. Um, because the hormones are a lower steady state, um, the lining in the uterus doesn't get so thick, so it stays thinner. So people generally experience lighter periods, more predictable periods sometimes. Um, it also helps prevent the buildup of an, another kind, kind of hormone called prostaglandins, which cause the cramping. So cramps are less typically with the pill. And a lot of women will experience less PMS symptoms because of that same uh, low level of hormones all the time instead of a high big change in their hormone levels. Now everybody experiences taking the pill differently and everybody experiences taking medicines differently. So some women will not have a positive result with the pill, but there are lots of different kinds and we could always try to change them around, find different dosing, find different progesterones that might work better for an individual. Other benefits of being on birth control pills other than of course preventing pregnancy if you don't want to be pregnant is decreased risk of cancer and that's cancer in the uterus and cancer in the ovaries and that that positive prevention lasts for a long time even after you're off of the uh, birth control pills. Um, there are some risks to taking the pill and it can be uh, more if you're older, if you have high blood pressure, if you smoke, if you have migraines. Those are things that we may want to know about your history before we start you on a pill. Uh, some women can be on a pill safely, but as they get older, they may develop some medical problems that they need to stop it. Um, but there are a lot of other options then to, for period management and for birth control management. Sometimes women will experience in between bleeding, like bleeding when they're not supposed to be, when they're on the pill. And that can happen in the beginning when they first start a pill. And it can take maybe two months or three months to, for someone to get used to taking the pill. Um, but if you're very good about taking it every day at the same time, that risk is much less. So I feel like there's a lot of benefits to the pill. I think about it as a medication more necessarily than just birth control. And a lot of women find that it is um, a real benefit to their life. And plus, in some cases, especially women who have high risk of uh, cancer, uh, like family history of ovarian cancer, it can be really, really beneficial to help with prevention. So if there's any questions about the pill, feel free to give our office a call and we certainly can help you with that or anything else you might need.